Alright guys, here we go. October, my aquarium box for the plant to tank. Haven't opened it yet, all I've done is cut the tape. As usual, just going to do a quick unboxing. Uh, one thing I wanted to point out, I haven't made videos in a little while. I have a bunch of footage, um, got to edit some stuff, put it together. I've been extremely, extremely busy with other things. Um, after all those things calm down, come November 6th, November 6th, things will calm down for me quite a bit. So, um, after that day, I will, you know, hopefully be able to get more of this stuff and this content out to you guys. Um, I'm going to go ahead and post the September video very shortly, uh, and then this one after. I try to, at this point, I'm trying not to have spoilers for the box, uh, but just to put the information out there so people can decide if they want to subscribe to my aquarium box. So, here we go. Uh, as always, all the info on top. We've got um, some Omega-1 photo contest information. Maybe you can win some Omega-1 food maybe uh, free fish food for a year so that's always neat uh, let's see the aquatic experience is a really big conference um, in New Jersey I believe so anyway that's a big thing advertisement there I'm assuming the guys from my aquarium box will be there here we go winners um, the mega box last month's winners Billy pipes and OCA for the mega box and then the free box was e collins so guys keep doing this stuff and submitting it trying to win they like giving those things out all right here you go uh with some orders you get free frags free fish uh free betta free plants from h2o plants that kind of stuff java moss this time and then we have our scorecard with our sponsor list and everything so let's go ahead and get started and see what we have in this month's box. Uh, surface cleaning gloves. Surface cleaning gloves. These are $8.99. Let's see. Aquarium glass and surface cleaning gloves. Great for cleaning corners and hard to reach areas. Uh, not for use with acrylic wash and dry for reuse. So I guess you just put them on your hands and scrub the side of the tank down. That might actually work really well with my big uh, 32 or 36 gallon. That's kind of deep. So let's see. Here we go. Some freeze dried brine shrimp. I'm sure my fish will like that. I don't have many fish right now, so I don't use a whole lot. Um, this is a uh, $10 value, my aquarium box branded stuff. Uh, here we go. Another little nano piece of spider wood. It's like a $7 value. This would be nice in a little nano aquarium. Uh, I need to set up something soon, a new little tank of some sort. I need to get a quarantine set up. Uh, these are... I have no idea. Grease pencils for writing on glass. Um, that would come in handy for a fish store, writing prices. But also, like if you want to write the date somewhere in the corner of your aquarium of when you change stuff, change the water when you fertilize, things of that nature, so that way you can kind of keep track easily. Uh, you can do that. Uh, let's see. Here we go. Classic flow sponge. Uh, so a little sponge filter. This would actually be perfect for the um, uh, what a quarantine tank that I need to set up. And I was just thinking I need to get one of these. Uh, this here is about $11 value. And then we've got Kima Pure Green. Uh, this is, let's see, about a $10 value, all-in-one filter media in a nylon bag. So I guess it's in this container, ready to go. Let's see, I'm curious. Yeah, it's some sort of 
filter media I don't know exactly what it is it wasn't sealed but it's carbon activated carbon so that could come in handy when you're pulling some chemicals or something out of the filter so that's everything this month in the box a $51 value uh, some pretty neat stuff I mean I really needed this I was gonna get one soon anyway um, wood is always good to have laying around these are actually gonna come in handy this I'm sure all fish would love these eh, you know take them or leave them kind of thing so I might utilize them at some point these little grease pencils doubtful but you never know uh, maybe to mark water lines so I know how much of a water change I'm doing on the glass something like that so anyway that is the October planted box um, useful stuff some neat stuff some things that are worth just keeping around as usual sorry about the wiggly camera the cat keeps rubbing all over the tripod here anyway um, thanks again hopefully this lets you guys know whether or not you want to continue with my aquarium box I'm on the fence quite often if I want to continue just because I'm building up a lot of stuff but uh, for now I think I'm gonna stick with it most of the stuff is quite useful um, you know, worst case scenario, I can give things to other friends in the hobby. So go ahead, like, share, comment, ask questions, any of that kind of stuff. Make sure to subscribe to the channel. I promise more content coming soon. Thanks for being patient with that stuff, guys. Have a good one.